viewers so welcome to the next session of the anatomy series so today's topic of my discussion is about the lymphatic drainage of the tongue so viewers in the upcoming videos i'll be beginning with the uh, development of the tongue the arterial supply of the tongue the muscles of the tongue the nerve supply of the tongue i'll be all discussing about it but today's topic of my discussion is about the lymphatic drainage and i have made it very simpler just by dividing this is the schematic diagram what i have drawn of the tongue so students out there it is not resembling the actual tongue but the diagram what i have made is certainly going to help you to remember about the divisions or and to what are the areas of the tongue which is going to drain into what kind of the lymph nodes so starting with the lymphatic drainage of the tongue so students out there here i have drawn the diagram of the tongue so the entire tongue students out there the entire tongue can be divided into the anterior most part of the tongue that is the tip of the tongue all right the tip of the tongue it is one region of the tongue next moving on to the right and left halves of the anterior two third it can again be divided into the right right and the left halves of the anterior two third now moving on to the posterior the next division of the next part what is to be considered is about the posterior one third of the tongue and moving on to the another cat another region that is the posterior most part of the tongue so the entire tongue can be divided into these following four regions that is the first is the tip of the tongue next moving on to the right and left halves of the anterior part of the tongue the next part what it can be divided into the posterior part of the tongue and ultimately finally the tongue it is the posterior most part of the tongue can be looked upon so the every region of the tongue is going to drain into a specific particular kind of a lymph node so students out there i would be like i would be mentioning you it is an these are the lymph nodes what i have drawn in blue these blue colored what i have drawn these are the lymph nodes over here and these arrows indicate as to where are the drainage is going to occur in what kind of the lymph nodes so beginning with the anterior that is the tip of the tongue so the tip of the tongue is going to drain into the submental wow. lymph nodes so this submental lymph nodes it is draining the anterior part of the tongue and the tip of the tongue now moving on to the anterior one third of the tongue so anterior two third particularly this is the anterior two third of the tongue what i have drawn so this anterior two third of the tongue is going to drain into the submandibular lymph nodes that is the anterior two third can again be draw brought can again be divided into the right part and the left part so the anterior two third the right and left halves of the anterior two third of the tongue drains into the submandibular lymph nodes so now moving on to the posterior part of the tongue so the posterior part of the tongue drains into the lower deep cervical lymph nodes which are located deep in the neck region and the lymph nodes of the tongue are the very important i would like to mention here is the jugular omohyoid lymph nodes so the jugular omohyoid lymph nodes these are the very famous commonly called as the lymph nodes of the tongue so students out there the posterior one third of the tongue is going to drain into the lower deep cervical lymph nodes and the jugular omohyoid lymph nodes and moving on to the most posterior most part of the tongue it is going to drain into the upper deep cervical lymph nodes so that's a short summary what i have written over here so the first the first thing is that is the tip of the tongue so the tip of the tongue is going to drain into the submental lymph nodes i have already shown over here students moving on to the right and left halves of the anterior two third it is going to drain into their counterparts that is the submandibular on both the sides of the right and left so they drain into the submandibular lymph nodes moving on to the posterior one third of the tongue it drains into the jugular omohyoid nodes and students i have already told you that this jugular omohyoid nodes these are also called as the lymph nodes of the tongue so the posterior one third of the tongue drains into the jugular omohyoid lymph nodes 
and the last and the ultimate part of the tongue that is the posterior most part of the tongue it drains into the upper deep cervical lymph nodes so students by the help of a schematic diagram i have divided the entire tongue into the regions as to where they are drawn and these arrows are depicting as to where are the drainage occurring into what lymph nodes these these particular regions are going to drain so students out there if you do like my video don't forget to like my video subscribe and share and do press the bell icon so that you can be further connected and stay connected for the upcoming videos so viewers thank you for watching